Music Skills today, we got a special group of Brainiacs guys, the stars of Nickelodeon! Woo! Kendall Schmidt from Big Time Rush once stapled his own figure in elementary school. Just call him Big Time Klutz. Liz Gillies from Victorious used to throw parties with her schoolmates for her imaginary friends. Sierra Bravo from Big Time Rush has been horseback riding for six years. She sure looks giddy up here. Ariana Grande from Victorious used to collect stuffed animals, Halloween masks, and hockey pucks. Hope she doesn't end up in the penalty box. Carlos Pena from Big Time Rush is a licensed rescue scuba diver. Will he have to rescue his castmates in level one? And Matt Bennett from Victorious spent an hour looking for a seat at the Kids' Choice Awards. Could someone tell him he's at the wrong podium? All right, one of you guys is going to be today's Brain Search champion and play for a lucky, eligible audience member who could win thousands of dollars in prizes, plus a sliming from head to toe. But I must warn you, for the rest of you, there is one way out of here. And it is down the brain. So we can get started. Level one. All right, who wants to see the big time rush team take it home today? Woo! All right, well, what about the victorious team? Who wants to see those guys get it? Oh man, we got a game on our hands. You all know how to play. You're gonna use that special game pod you got in front of you to lock in your answers. And if you hit three four times in a row, Carlos will get a wedgie. This first level will test your ability to see things quickly. As always, I'm kicking it off with a 10-point puzzle, and here it comes. I can juggle lots of things at once. Keep track of how many items I'm juggling. Including the balls, how many total items was I juggling? Let's see what the correct answer is. For 10 points, it was number seven. All right, who's got it right? Oh, everybody's getting it right. That's 10 points across the board, just like that. All right, nice job. That's a way to start it off, guys. Good job. All right, this next puzzle is worth 20 points. Shake it off, here it comes. I was working at the drive-thru and had the most annoying customer ever. Pay close attention to what she says. May I take your order? Um, yeah, I'd like a hamburger with cheese and onions. No wait, instead of cheese, give me lettuce. And actually forget the onions. You know what, let's make it a cheeseburger. And on second thought, I'll have tomato instead of lettuce. Which of these burgers did the girl order? Let's see what the correct answer is. Two. Um, no, wait, that one. Yeah. Ah, two points to see a lot of happy feet out there, happy feet. Yeah. And that's the reason why, because yeah. everyone's getting 20 points for their score. Yes. This next puzzle is worth 30 points. Take a look. My favorite thing about Halloween? Making jack-o'-lanterns. Pay close attention to the parts of the pumpkin I cut out. Which of these pumpkins did I just carve? It was too, oh, you, you guys need more time? Please. Yeah, just a little Sorry, bit. Sorry, can't oh. do it. <laughs> Come on. You know what? Let's just find out what the correct answer is. There it is. It was number two. Let's see who got it right. Yeah! Kendall is the yeah. only one who got it right. Yeah. I kind of just didn't get her answer in on time. Bing, bang, bang, bang. That puzzle Bing, definitely bang, bang. separated a few of us here. Let's see what the scores are at this moment. Kendall, you lead the way with 60 points. Nice job, guy. Sierra, 
Sarah, Matt, Carlos, Liz, and Ariana, you guys all have 30 Let's points. Go, Come on, let's go, Rather be 30 years old than 60 years old. Oh, you know, that's a good point, Matt. A very True. good point. What about who would like to be 50 years old? Ah. Uh, because this next puzzle is worth 50 right. points. Whoa. And here it comes. I'd like to be a winner. Check out my new high tech food maker. I went to make some applesauce, but a worm crawled into one of the compartments. Keep track of which compartment has the worm. Which compartment has the worm? Wow, that puzzle was a big I, time no, difficult. I know, I have no idea. Oh, Gave some big time trouble, right? right? Yeah. yeah. Does anyone need a big time break? I do. No. I can use a bathroom break. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what the correct answer is. It's a replay. Keep your eye on that red one. 50 points on the board. Where will it end? Yeah. It's over there. We're down to our last puzzle. After right. this, the four of you with the most points are going to advance to the next level, and the other two are going down. The oh, man. And this is the way I like to play it right here. This puzzle is worth 100 points, and it's anybody's game. Here it comes. I'm about to bungee jump down to the first floor. Don't try this at home. Keep track of which floor I end up on. Whoa! Ah! <laughs> which floor did I end up on? All right, 100 points on the board, Sierra. If you think you got this one right, give me your best bungee jumping face. No, I don't think I got it right. You don't <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? The face was priceless, and thank you very much for that. Let's find out what the correct answer is for 100 big ones. It was yeah! number three. Woo! Okay, let's see who got it right. Oh Ariana, Matt, Kendall, and Carlos got it right. Woo! A lot of happy Woo! feet up there, and that's what I like to see. Okay. Now, it's time to find out which four of you are moving on to level two uh, and which two wait, are going down the bridge. In first place with 210 points, which means he did not miss a single puzzle. From Big Time Rush, it's Kendo. With 180 points in second place from Victorious, it's Mac. With 130 points in third place from Big Time Rush, it's Carlos. Woo! Come on, all the way, going all the way. All right, here it is, guys, the moment of truth. There are three of you left and only one more spot to move on to the next level. Also with 130 points moving on is Ariana from Victoria. Yeah, You head on over to the brain drain and I'll meet you there. Yeah. 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 All right, guys, it's two versus two. Big time rush versus victorious. Who's gonna win it? Victorious. Big time rush! Yeah. Yeah. All right, I'll let you guys figure that out. I'm gonna go head over to the brain drain.
special episode. It's the stars of Nickelodeon competing. <laughs> Let me be the first to congratulate the four you brainiacs for making it here, level two. Let's get to know you guys a little better, shall we? Kendall, let's start with you. An impressive uh, showing in level one. You know, I try. I try my best. How many points did you have again? I Was it like 210? 210, which would mean perfect. Perfect score. That's right. Representing Big Time Rush. Nice job. Matt. Hey. All right. How's shooting for Victoria's going? It's super fun. Yeah, super you happy enjoyable. to be here? I am absolutely happy to That's be here. That's right. Good answer, Matt. Carlos, over to you. What's up? What's up? All right. Uh, there's a prank that happened recently. Yes. You want to tell me about it? Yeah, I uh, put a, a stink bomb in the set, and it basically had to stop production because it smelt up the entire soundstage. <laughs> a room bigger I, than this. It was bigger I than bet this you, room. you were very popular. <laughs> no. <laughs> nice job. Ariana! From Victorious. I'm seeing something up here. You're the only female. you got to represent the girls here today. I know. I'm the only girl. You ready for that? I guess so. <laughs> All right, good luck. Enough chit chat. Let's get to the game. Level two. On this level, I'm going to tell you a story from Jeff's big book of super fantastic true chronicles of truth that are absolutely true. On your feet, it's story time. Oh, All right. right. Now remember, you're going to want to listen and pay close attention to everything you're about to hear, okay. and everything I'm about to tell you is 100% true. Okay. I love toys. So I jumped at the chance to visit my favorite toy maker's workshop. I was so excited when I found the golden ticket good for a tour of Billy Bonker's toy factory. My brother Bobby and sister Courtney came along too. Billy Bonker's arrived in an elevator made of ice. Welcome! There's only one rule, don't touch the toys. Then it was off to see how Mr. Bonkers, along with his helpers, the Baboon Palumpas, made all of his top-selling toys. There was the Super Spitter, Booger Babies, and even the Turbo Go-Go Pogo Stick. Then we entered a room filled with Mr. Bonkers' newest video game, B.O. Ogres. Without thinking, Bobby grabbed the game controller and started playing. Suddenly, he was sucked into a video game world and was being chased by odorous ogres. Before Courtney and I could do anything, Billy Bonkers hurried us into another room. The Baboon Palumpas were busy assembling the doll with a sweet smile, Buffy Burp. Courtney reached out to hug one, and like that, she was turned into a life-size doll. Then I was whisked into a room with Bonkers' most popular creation, Robobat. As I moved Whoa. in for a closer look, Bonkers got ready to bonk me. Hold it! I have an idea for the biggest selling toy of all time. But first, I want my brother and sister back. So we helped launch Bonkers' craziest toy of all, the Billy Bonkers action figure. Only $24.99. Get yours today. That's my story, wow. and it's all 100% true. Wow. Oh, man. All right, man. All right luck, you, guys you guys know how to play, right? Yeah. Yeah. Let's do it. Kendall, we're going to start with you. What type of factory did I visit? A toy factory. Sit and hold. Let's find out. You got it. What did I find that earned me admission to the toy factory? A golden ticket. A golden ticket. Let's find out. You got it. Good job. Carlos, oh. over to you. The toy factory owner had a giant mallet concealed inside of what? Uh, a box? Concealed inside of a box. Let's find out. Sit and hold. See ya! No! Same question to you. The toy factory owner had a giant mallet concealed inside of what? Um... I'm gonna need an answer. Give me something. Um, Throw it out there. A bonker. A bonker. Let's find out. Oh, no, Cindy! Oh, Kendall Matt, guess what? You guys are one step closer to being today's Brain Search champion. The correct answer, by the way, was Top Hat. Top Hat. You guys knew it. I wouldn't have gotten it. You wouldn't have gotten it. If it would have came to me, I would have gotten it, so I'm excited. All right. Well, this is what dreams are made of right here. It's Big Time Rush versus Victorious. I say we settle this with a knockout round. Yeah. Knockout round. Behind those numbers are pairs of images from the story you just heard. Make a match, you stay in the game. I'm gonna give you 10 seconds to memorize the board, and that time starts right now. Kendall, let's
let's start with you. What's your first number? One. One. And eight. And eight. That's a match. Very nice. Matt, over to you. What's your first number? Two. Two. And nine. And nine. That is also a match. Kendall, back to you. Six. Six. Oh, wow. I uh, wasn't expecting that. No, I picked the wrong <laughs> one. Sixteen. Sixteen. Not a match. We are now in sudden death territory. The next correct match is today's Brain Search champion. And judging by the smirk on Matt's face... He knows it. You know it, there. don't you? Ten. Ten. Very confident. No! And twelve. No! And twelve! Ah! Matt, you are the Brain Search champion. Victorious is victorious. Kendall, have a seat and hang on. You played a great game. Oh! Matt, we're doing one of those. Yeah! yeah! You are today's Brain Search champion. <laughs> you are about to play the final stage for a lucky eligible audience member who can win thousands of dollars in prizes, plus the sliming from head to toe. Why don't you head on over to the floor, and I'm going to go to the brain drain. Woo! playing for. Are you guys ready out there? All right. Cheyenne, get on over here. Yeah. Come right over here, Cheyenne. Get between me and Matt. All right. You think yeah. Matt's got it in him? I know he does. All right. Yeah. Any any words of encouragement you have for him? Just do a good job and work <laughs> hard. <laughs> okay, Matt, you're about to play the final stage where you could win, Cheyenne, thousands of dollars in prizes, plus a sliming she is never going to forget. Level three, the final stage. This level's got three parts. Each one's more difficult than the last. It's your job to memorize the light pattern that appears on the floor and then recreate it. We're going to start you off with a four by four. Then you are going to stop the clock by stepping on that button all the way up there. Boom, you do that prizes. You're going to come back here. We're going to do a five by five and a six by six. Complete all three paths in 90 seconds. And here's what Cheyenne can win. Complete the four by four and win a Casio LK270 keyboard. The Casio 61 key keyboard features lighted key step up lesson system, 152 built in songs, 180 rhythms, MP3 connections, and a five song six track recorder in a portable design. Complete the five by five and win a Fuji digital camera. The Fujifilm XP10 digital camera is waterproof to 10 feet, shockproof from 3 feet, dustproof, and freezeproof to 14 degrees Fahrenheit. Complete the 6x6 and win a Nickelodeon Florida getaway. You'll fly for a three-day, two-night stay with accommodations provided by Nickelodeon Suites Resort in Orlando, Florida. The resort features water parks, live entertainment, and Nickelodeon-themed suites. You'll have a chance to meet characters like SpongeBob SquarePants and Dora the Explorer and to get slimed. All right. Cheyenne, did I, did I get a sense that you were a cheerleader there? Oh, this is going to be perfect. Give, you think you got a little cheer for Matt here? Let's see. Maybe. All right, let's hear it. Let's go, Matt. Let's go. Hey, hey Matt, if you can't do it after that, I don't know what can. I feel inspired. I All right. Sure I could before, but now I can't. I got 90 seconds. It's up on the board. Ooh. Matt, here is your four by four. Take a look. You will see it twice. Okay. The clock will start when you make your first step. Good luck, Matt. <sighs> All right, Shan. Wait. And he's off. <laughs> oh, no, bro. Boom! Just like that. Come on back, Matt. Woo. Boom. High five. High five. Yeah. Matt, you just got
got, Cheyenne, your new best friend, a keyboard. How's nice. that sound? Feeling good about awesome. that? Yeah. All right, you play the keys? I'm going to learn. That's yeah. right, you're going to learn. Here is the 5x5. Five five. This is for the camera. Take a look. All right, Matt, good luck. Okay, thank you. Here we go. Let's hear that cheer, Cheyenne. Oh, no. Oh. Hurry back. Take another look. Oh, no. Oh, the okay. audience is gotcha. into it. Cheyenne, gotcha. how about it? Wow, look at those. No. Oh, no. no. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Why? I'll take care of the clock. You take care of the pass. Okay. He's got it. I think he's got it. He's got that nice little side step. Yeah. Come on back, buddy. All there right. it is. That one was hard. Camera. That was a little harder, but you know what? You got plenty of time left. You got 58 seconds to win Cheyenne the trip and the sliming. I can do it. Take a look. Yeah. Here comes one more time. When you're okay. ready. I can do it. Cheyenne, you think he's got this one? Yeah, you think you're going on a trip? Ha <laughs> ha